one of the global methods that is available to us globally inside Node.js is the require method. Now the require method is a method that uh, allow us to import external modules inside this file. And I'm going to import the read line module, which exists uh, inside Node.js by default, and it's a wrapper around the std out and the std in, so that we can like simplify the process of getting data from the terminal and output it inside the uh, 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 also inside the terminal. Now let's uh, create a variable for this module read line, and this is how we can use it. Going, I'm going to create a variable named rl, and then use the read line, and then create an interface. And inside this interface, it's first it's a method that accepts an object, and inside this object we can pass the input, and we can use the process dot sdt in as the input, and for the output we can use process dot sdt out. Now how we can run this? It's very simple. Just use the question method and pass your question like uh, what's your name and here we will have to pass a uh, callback that takes in an answer so we're going to get the answer and we're going to simply log it to the uh, terminal right here take the answer and then save the main.js file Let's open up the uh, terminal and run the main.js file and see what's going to happen. All right. What's your name? Like John. All right. That's our answer, but it seems that I uh, made a typo. Here, what's your name? Save again, close and rerun it. What's your name? John. And that's it. That's it. Now again to automatically exit from the terminal you can grab this and put it inside the curly braces, paste it here and then use the process.exit to automatically exit. Now let's clear this in node main.js John and that's it.